Hello everyone! And for those whom this video is their first interaction with us, welcome to Travel Buddies. Here we take strolls around the city, but we love to travel the world. We appreciate the support, so kindly hit the like and subscribe button. And let's see where we're going today. Any guesses? Let me give you a hint. The end of the year, shopping. Yes, a shopping center, but which one? Let us know your thoughts in the comments. Now, let's begin the walk. As you recall in the previous videos, we have mentioned that the Iranian year is ending, so renewing everything is a tradition. Today, we're taking you to north of Tehran, where there is a grand shopping center is located. In Saad al Abad neighborhood, you can come here by subway, just get off on Kedab Square and when you come out of the station, you'll see a huge building in front of you but you gotta walk about 5 or 6 minutes to get there That building is Opal Center a 13th floor building plus 7 floors underground for parking lots it is so big we could only show you eight floors in this vlog we'll show the rest of the building in the near future hopefully there are multiple guide frames next to every elevator and escalator so you'll know where to get off and access what you want more easily but if you just want to take a stroll and walk and enjoy your free time then be our guest because you won't leave this place without at least one shopping bag the thing is it's not just a shopping center it's much more it has other options to offer, such as different food courts, multiple hallways and floors for gaming for all ages, cafes and even daycare. There is also a chain market and multiple roof gardens due to its design and construction. There are drug stores, dry cleaning, bakery and others. Every floor is named Opal something. Like the first floor is called Opal Home and it's dedicated to house designing, furnitures and tools. The second floor is Opal Mode and it goes till the very end you can find anything from clothes to technology devices and etc it's a complete department store 
The thing that makes this place different from other malls is that it pays attention to the kids. For example, there is an area in there called Jobstown, which introduces different jobs to the kids and let them know the pros and cons. There are snack bars all around the place, and there is one that sells ice cream like Rhodes, and it was really crowded. Oh, and there was this another ice cream shop that lets you make your own ice cream, but then charges you like double or even more than a normal ice cream. But it's fun for the kids, isn't it? Anyway, each floor starts working in different hours. But the safe time to visit all is probably between 11 a.m. till 10 p.m. You can look it up on the internet and know even more. So, have you visited there yet? If you have, what did you like about this place? Take care of yourself. All the love, travel buddies.
Thank <laughs> you. 